Heal. Quick heal. Heal, 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 heal. Use their cover against them. Cover. Red shirt's down. Oh no, that's not good. Ow, you so and so. Can I can I not be punching? Can I maybe be using my weapons instead? Please. How silly am I? Oh goodness, there's loads of them. Oh, get it back in the tent. Oh. <laughs> Greetings, adventurers. It is I, Les Grumbles, and we're back with part five of our Conan Exiles. Let's play beginner friendly playthrough. Uh, we unlocked last time out. Uh, the knowledge of how to construct a golem. So uh, I figured let's uh, have a go at that, shall we? Which is, explains, hopefully, partially at least, why my pockets are full and I'm walking very slowly. <laughs> I've also changed my armor a little bit. So first things first, we've got a whole load of bits and bobs. Oh no, is it going to do that thing to me again? Oh no, it's going to hate. What? 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 Why can't I put this thing down? Oh my goodness, game. Overlapping. So what? Too far. Right, too far. Overlapping with another. Okay. Right. I've got a workaround for this. After the fiddling we had to do to get this one to sit down. I have a workaround. And it's called moving stuff. So I'm going to move that over there. Then I'm going to see, can I? Overlapping. How big is the hitbox of yes. this yes, of this buildable? Oh, there we go. We got it. Okay, boom. So, place it down. Look at that. That's pretty cool, isn't it? And then, move it afterwards. Again, we're running the Pippi mod, so uh, we can do resizing. We do all sorts of funky things. I'm going to, I think it plonks it down that way by the looks of it. So I've just built this little uh, platform here in the water and we're just going to throw that down there like that. That's terrible placement. We're going to pick it up and we're just going to throw that down there like that. <laughs> That'll do. Oh, it's horribly off center. I don't want to trigger people. Okay, that's not bad. That's that's pretty good. Okay, right. Let's go and put this one back on the thing here before I forget. Uh, da -da. All right, there we go. So, look at this. Isn't this cool? So, we've got the Guardian Assembly Station. Uh, and what you can see here, not all parts are present. Well, obviously, I haven't put any in there yet. Uh, but this is where we're going to put the head, the torso, left arm, right arm, left leg, right leg together. And then animate a Guardian. Now, we've already been locking off to pick up a bunch of spare bits and bobs for them, which I think are stored in this box here. So let's grab um, a head, torso. We're only doing stone right now. That's the only one we've unlocked. So we've got a head and a torso. That's going to save us a bit. Let's chuck those in. All right, I'm excited about this. This will be the second time ever that I've built a guardian. Uh, here we go. And the first time I've done it in like a standard playthrough way. So nice. There we go. Uh, we definitely, as I said, we've outgrown this spot here for our base. But we're going to do... Um, I figure we could have a go at a purge. And see how that works out for us. Um, okay. Stone Guardian Empty Arm uh, needs 200 stone, 50 stone consolidant, 10 reinforcements iron, and 5 blood crystals. So, because we fought that chappy, we already have 22 of those. The stone consolidant we make in the potion maker, the alchemy, uh, with plant fiber and something else I've forgotten right now. I think resin. Um, okay. Let's craft one of those. It looks like, numbers-wise, we might have just enough. Oh, we leveled up as well. Excellent. We needed that. Um, so, there is one empty arm. Let's make one empty leg. As I said, we were lucky that we got the um, 
the blood crystal or we we would need more if we needed to make the torso and everything okay now what do i need to make an axe arm for example which i think we can use to gather um uh wood with or do we want one with us a saw that's a two-handed iron sword or a two-handed iron great axe okay oh i might not have that unlocked interesting uh, an iron war hammer i think we picked one of those up we might have scrapped it though and and a an iron sickle okay let's go and see if we've got any of those weapons because we're going to need those uh we need to craft obviously another arm and another leg oh gave me another level what the wow okay um, so you get a lot for crafting these. It's worth it, even if you're just using it to level with. <laughs> um, okay, so now we have the arms and the legs together. Uh, let's go and... I don't think you can... I think one of them has to have a tool. Let's go and learn, shall we? Because I'm not entirely uh, certain. Do, 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 do. Uh, I swapped out a couple of my armor pieces. So I've got heavy sabatons and heavy gauntlets from the standard set um, and they're giving me carry capacity um, to try and help with the fact that I don't have the expertise however the rest of the kit is giving me buffed health which I feel is necessary given the way I fight badly um, <laughs> regrettably this means that my carry weight is uh, rather low and uh, I'm, so I'm struggling a bit so we might have to change some of our armor up um, oh wait I didn't pick a torso up Oh, no, I already put it in. Okay. So, I put the legs. One arm. Wait. Leg. Uh, other leg. Um, so, inventory size 5. Health 9,000. 9,000. But again, he can't ever heal. So, when that goes, he goes poof. Armor 288. So, not really a great armor score, to be honest. Um, can you place that? Not all required parts of... Okay. Okay. So this is good. It stops you from making a mistake. So we have to take that arm and put some kind of implement in it. So let's have a look in our bag of goodies. See if we've got any um, uh, bits and bobs. Let's see. Uh, not in there. We've got cutlass and a steel javelin. Okay, so we don't have what they need. So what we could do is we could create the iron sickle and then he's purely going to be a resource gatherer I guess he can't fight with a sickle right so he could go out and farm fiber for us not necessarily a bad thing um, let's see though if uh, let's spend our attributes we're going to carry on going up our tree here towards full authority um, let's see oh this is going to be tricky because I want like, so many things juggling vying for my uh, attention we've got the butcher to make steel skinning knife and steel cleaver uh we've got apiarist to get beehives up and running and get honey which is great for food and drink uh we've got brewing to unlock behind that we've got better farming equipment we've also got the wheel of pain which i really want to unlock because that's going to allow us to uh repair our iron truncheons and make more raw hide bindings and things and also convert more than one thrall at a time uh that's the biggest benefit um of the larger wheels i think and probably processing quicker as well i'm not sure about that um water well that's something that's one of our journeys oh this is so tricky and then for the to make our chappy here um where's the two-handed that's the short sword Oh, jeez. Iron War Axe. Where's the Great Axe? Iron Axe. I'm not sure where the... Hmm, let's see. Steel Warhammer. So, Iron Warhammer we could unlock. Oh, here we go. Two-handed Iron Great Axe. Oh, these aren't two-handed like that. Okay. Let's get the... I think we should get this one. Although, he, he could get the rocks for us. We're going to need a lot of rocks. I want to give him the, the Warhammer, you know. So I'm going to unlock Iron Warhammer and we'll make one of those on here. This is great. All this, love, love this learning. Okay. Iron Warhammer. A uh, boop. Right. 
and we go back to this workstation we put the arm back in we put the warhammer in that allows us to make stone guardian maul arm uh boom we gained another le oh amazing that was worth spending the points then wonderful okay let's go over here i'm excited i am excited let's go come on stony uh right boom we have all the parts placed armor goes up to 320 autonomously harvest rocks there you go it tells you what it does harvest metals and autonomously harvest rocks okay cool <gasps> we could we could put it we need an iron run okay we could put him near an iron node maybe okay so here we go craft huzzah use the sorcerous ways animate this pile of stones with no bones look at that beautiful we gained a bit of corruption boom <laughs> oh when he pops out the thing is it's massive and then when he actually just he's still a big fella but it's like come on leave it at that giant size um here we go so we see he's got 100 percent of himself 9,000 hit points but he cannot ever be healed his inventory contains nothing harvesting is nothing the golem will seek out and harvest these resources so if i put i believe that if i put stone in there he will um let's put him on aggressive we want him to fight anything that comes near him uh i want to turn down his chase radius though i don't want him charging off getting destroyed okay let's uh let's put him to the test shall we come on buddy let's go i don't know what his range is in terms of oh why wow, he runs real fast i was kind of thinking he might be like a jump 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 he has got the heavy steps though that's awesome where's he going why what, what why is he over there what are you doing over oh i think he's now looking for stone but he's on follow okay here we go stop following oh, okay so he follows so does he go to try to autonomously harvest the resources even when he's on follow so he's always doing something around you maybe that's what it is let's bring him over here where there's these stones see what he does maybe it's this aggressive setting i don't know oh hello he's found some stones oh yeah so that's what he's gonna do he's gonna hammer out the stones even when he's on follow oh that's that's interesting so i wonder if i took the stones off of him he's already gathered 32 okay so it's not super quick or nothing but look if instead of me having to spend time gathering stone he's gonna do it for us i've got no problem with that i'm assuming they're 1000 stacks like normal so that's fairly decent and he's pretty hardy so he can probably look after himself if he gets in trouble over here i wonder if i take that away if he then stops it looks like he stops harvesting then he stopped looking for the stone okay so if you don't want him doing that behavior when he's following you just uh take the stone out of his pockets is i wonder if i can put armor in there as well uh, no armor i mean iron i wonder if you put iron in there too i guess that's what you should do really if you want him to harvest okay this is kind of cool though i like it um can he i'm going to assume because he doesn't have that tool that i can't get him to harvest plant fiber can't okay you can't it doesn't let you put that in there there you go okay awesome all right so it kind of shows you what it's doing let's see what he's up to in a fight then let's get this get all these guys annoyed hello golem golem what? Gollum? Go, go, hello? 
Help me. Oh, now I had to get hit first. Okay. Even though he was on aggressive. Are you going to hit those guys? Oh my goodness. <laughs> well, okay. Uh, a little bit hit and miss. Um, but interesting. Okay. Okay. It's, a, it's kind of funny anyway, isn't it? So you're not taking this guy with you, by the way, if you're going to go knock out thralls. He's going to end up uh, murderizing them all. Hello, don't mind me. I'm just taking your eggs. Come on, Gollum. Okay, so remember, double click of E means return to me. Or run over there looking for rocks, I guess. Let's uh, check him out in a fight up here. Buddy. Okay, so I would recommend if you're going to take him out as a companion for fighting in that, make sure to take this out of there so that he's not running off looking for rocks to hit all the time. Right, okay. Come on, buddy. Hello. Hello. Are you... You're on defend when attacked, okay. So he's taking some damage there. But he's also one-shotting our enemies. Alright then. That happened. Okay. So I'm assuming that as with the other things, he could carry some stuff for me. Yeah, okay. So he can carry stuff for you up here. And obviously he's carrying that stone. Here we go. Interesting. Okay, so it's, yeah. It's some pros and cons to it. But the fact that we can just have him around our base doing stuff no! is not bad. Thanks, buddy. All right, let's go. Uh, I'm not sure if he's on follow, I guess. I guess I could put him over here. And he'll just harvest this stone whenever it springs up. This could be his working area. We'll set him to move here. The thing is that camp eventually will probably kill him. Just by sheer numbers. You know, death by a thousand cuts. Or nine thousand cuts as it were. But he's on eight, eight, nine, nine. Okay, so even from these low level ones, he's taken a little bit of damage there. Because he's not that quick. And doesn't have any concept really of defending himself beyond the bare minimum all right so i got stand guard stop following yeah so i'll just put him on guard there and then he'll just wander around smacking rocks for us i think let's check this is what he's gonna do yeah he's guarding or does he just if he's guarding he doesn't do that huh Oh, okay. So if you put him on guarding, he doesn't gather the resources. That's, uh... Oh, no, he does. He does. It just took a while. Okay. So, a slight problem with that as well is you've got to have either another companion that can carry all the goods that he's harvested or deal with this kind of encumbrance. You know, close by the base, not really a problem further away a bit of a challenge all right well anyway that's the basics of golems uh, looked at we now know as well we learned by pure coincidence thankfully that uh, we know where to go and get ourselves a uh, more of that blood crystal uh, again if you go looking around for ages and ages and you really want to have one of those things gathering for you or fighting with you you know being a good distraction he's a good tank if nothing else um then you know always don't be too harsh on yourself in terms of like trying to work it all out just within the game because some of the things in the game are a little bit you know cryptic um or darn right almost impossible to find unless by pure chance uh you know don't be afraid to look some stuff up if you're looking for things 
and just can't find uh, find where they're at. Uh, use the wikis that are out there. Bear in mind, sometimes wikis are, uh, you know, it's a lot of volunteers and things, so there might be some errors in there, or there might be things that are out of date. But overall, I found the wiki to be uh, useful. Uh, I've been using the fandom one. Just the first one I kind of stumbled onto. All right, let's make some more of this. Okay, and then let's look and see if we can spend some of our points. Uh, authority. Okay, we're going to get the next perk. Attentive care. Your active followers receive 50% increased healing. Awesome. So for the golem, that wouldn't apply. But for red shirt, for example, that's going to be amazing. Uh, let's see. We don't have that horrible... Uh, tough decision. Okay, so now let's get Wheel of Pain unlocked. And... Uh, let's get Butcher unlocked so we can get a steel skinning knife. That's going to be handy. Looks like we've got tons of points to work with this time. Uh, we can get Master Roofer. Hang on, is there anything else we want? Oh, and at some point we're going to have to look at tinkering and that, which is all about improving your weapons and armor. And um, There's some really cool uh, little edges you can give yourself, as it were. Uh, numbing wraps, okay. Well, we've just got into healing wraps. I'll show you that in a moment. Um, I do like having the eight purists and the brewing. Oh, that reminds me. I think we might go and get ourselves, try and get ourselves an innkeeper. Um, you know what we could do? We could take the golem with us to that aggro camp where we fought the sorcerers, which is quite a tough challenge, quite a tough fight. And we could see how it works out taking our golem with us. Um, as a support guy, uh, we're not going to be able to knock anybody on the head with that, but that doesn't matter so much. Yeah, let's do that. I think that'll be fun to, uh, to learn, uh, how well he stands up to that, which is really, with the big jailer and everything, it's really quite a vicious fight. I'm um, just going to do that next, and then take it from there. There's also a sandstorm mask, uh, which is, has a really neat, uh other benefit but we'll get into that later on too um so okay we unlock butcher butchery let's unlock a purist why not um let's unlock brewing because that could be fun i've never looked at that in this game uh in depth anyway and we've got the wheel of pain okay so let's make a bigger wheel of pain because we're gonna go and uh pick up some some more workers um but also what do we need to make that? Also, we're going to... Um, ooh, that's quite hefty. Ooh, size of that. Oh, dear. Okay, change of plan. That's going to take more space than I have right now. So I'm going to have to extend the base again. I think we're going to start building over the water some more. I quite like this. I don't want to really give this up just yet. Although a base further north um, will be in the works somewhere down the line. Now that we've gotten to the master builder level as well. Um, but all in good time, all in good time. Okay, so I tell you what we'll do now. Let's go and test our golem in a much harder uh, fight scenario. It's that nasty camp that we had some trouble with, with those sorcerers and the jailer. Um, also, I just, you know, obviously, if the golems gathered a lot of resources for you, where is he? Uh, Gollum! We didn't give him a name yet either, did we? Stony. Gollum? Alright, so let's do uh, followers list. Uh, let's look for Guardian Gollum. Let's click on show follower marker here. If any of your folks go missing, I can't remember where you put them or something happened in transporting or whatever. Uh, and then you can click on the map and they should have a little uh, eye icon or a little, sorry, person icon like that, little meeple. So he's up there somewhere ahead of us. Wouldn't be surprised if he got into a fight with these guys. Oh no, here he is. So look at the size of the radius that this guy's following. His health hasn't been damaged, so they didn't respawn yet. He's gathered 276 stones. Okay, follow me, man. Oh, we've got to give you a name. Hmm. 
Guardian Golem. We call him GG. GG. Good game. <laughs> Come on, buddy. We're coming out. We're going home. Come on. There he is. Okay, I'm going to take that stone away so that he's just the uh, only following and not looking. It's an interesting system. I don't know why I'm seeing all these other little meeple icons now on the mini-map. That must just be a little bug or feature. Um, okay, so... Uh, First of all, we'll empty you out of this stuff. And then I will hop over to the other site. And uh, we'll resume over there. All right, here we are. Let's go, GG. Let's hope it is a GG. I hope you can take the hits. I'm also curious to see if they get hits on me, how my new heavy armor set holds up. I'm currently got armor of 727 interesting all right Gigi's done well against the uh, hyenas and alligators and things on the way here as you'd kind of expect ow he hit me gg get him thank you ow good night you don't have anything i want well actually you do you have this tink armor kit okay uh let's see weathered skull all right Come on, guys. This is this is this is the real test. Let's have a little pot just in case before we go in. Uh, okay. Hello. Could use my bowl to draw some of them out. We've done before this. What? I was robbed. Have it. Yeah, come on. GG. Oh. Now your time to shine, son. Oops, wrong press that button. Come on, GG. Help me out here, buddy. Ow. So you can see that authority thing again, a bit hit and miss. It's not exactly attractive at all, even when he's fighting. Roll. Okay, now he's got their attention. Find and defeat a sorcerer. Yes, I updated my journey path as well. Okay, he's taken quite a kicking. <laughs> he's down to 7,000 health now. 7,700 health. Come on. Give him a chance, you bully. Oh my god. That guy was just on one hit point the whole time. <laughs> I love you. I'll take your beef jerky. Okay, there's an iron hammer. That can save us having to make another one when we inevitably need another golem. Oh, cooked savory shellfish. Oh, thanks very much. Burl up satchel. There you go. Repair kit. Let's go. Right click. What did we get? A burlap pouch. Nice. I'd forgotten to pick any of those up. I couldn't cast any spells if I wanted to. We got the dead sorcerer's map. We got nine notes. Oh, we lucked out on that again. Okay, never mind. We know that there's another chap in here somewhere. Are you alright, buddy? <laughs> GG. Um, nevertheless, he's still up to the fight quite well. Uh, we'll get that guy out of a cage in a minute. I don't know if he's going to be a barkeeper. If we're super lucky. Oh, free gaseous orb. Oh, a flagon. Okay, I'll have that. Uh, simple weapon repair kit. Bone claws. Yeah, they're pretty low. Okay. Let's take this guy out. Hello. Sorcery inspection team. Good night. Uh, oh, Skelos Cultist Skirt. What? Light armor, value 8. Oh, okay. Ow! I forgot about that guy. Whoa! It, whoa, you literally exploded his body and knocked his head off. GG. Oh my god, okay. Yeah, nothing, uh, nothing else here. No sorcerer's books or anything. Uh, yeah, okay, so let's have a look. We got another cloth satchel. Right click, cloth pouch inside. Dead source of. Oh, 18 notes. What? Okay, well, we got stiffed on the goodies. 
Let's go and rescue this guy. Had a look in there already. Okay. All right. Jailer's key. Thankfully, we had two now. So we got another one. You've rescued this guy. He's an exile level two fighter. Eh. I'm sorry, buddy. I don't need you. So, break bond. Yes. Gives you what he had on him. Two handed stone, so none of that's really worth anything. Even breaking it down is not going to give much. Okay, no lock there. But uh, yeah, that was a good example of how uh, how the stone golem is in a fight. You could see that the big jailer was a bit more than a match for him because he was knocking him over with his sequence. I guess it might depend who got their sequence in first. If uh, if our golem. Uh, got got in on the uh, on the job first. Maybe our animation would have trumped their animation. I'm not sure. You'll have to uh, yeah try that out if you're interested. But I certainly think you know as a tank goes, uh, obviously just having the huge hit point pool, uh, it's pretty cool. It's pretty good. I think it's fun. Something different anyway, isn't it? Uh, let's go down here, wipe out this camp and the other camp at the end. I know this is a repeat, but if we quickly go along here beat these up maybe we'll get the uh, innkeeper at the other place uh, Bonty community member Bonty has been playing along and learning the game having won a copy on a, one of our live streams is uh, also tell, tell, tells me that the uh, cages if they're empty when you come up to them you just go out of render range and come back and there should be somebody in there oh hello cheeky Oh, you're an armor level three. Well, that's okay, because we've got ends. Yeah, down you go. Sack of sods. All right, let's have a look. Nothing exciting there. A banner. Can't resist these banners, man. Uh, I'll take the heads. Nice. Where's that banner? The furry banner. That looks pretty cool. Okay, let's go. Gotta check your body. Healing wrap. Oh, bug soup. Don't mind if I do. Lovely. Uh, I'm not going to take on that big camp over there. Because we know all about that one now. Uh, never did find out what... Uh, but I did have confirmation from some other folks that they had that sound. That there should be a ghost or some lore here. Uh, that triggered down there last time out. Um, but no one's really seen where, that's, uh, where that guides you to or what the lore is that you unlock there. So... Still no idea on that one, unfortunately. Uh, while we're here, we can beat up that uh, blood crystal um, monster again. Get some more blood crystals, since we know that that's here. Come on. Wait. It's not... What? Where is it? Maybe not enough time has passed since this is single player. That could be it. All right. Be surprised at that, though. I thought everything respawned once you uh, went out and back in again. Ow! Ow! Get him! Wow, I am bad at this game. At fighting. My goodness. I am terrible at this. <laughs> Get him. Luckily, I brought my golem. Yeah, down you go. So many archers. Yeah, don't shoot at my golem. That's completely fine with me. I'll just attack this rock. Oh, hello. Ow! She caught me right here. Holy bonobo. I will feast upon you. Yeah, so what you don't want to do is you don't want to abandon your golem to the fight. Because, again, Yog look at that 9,000 HP. Flesh. It's not taking that long for that all to disappear, is it? All right, since we knocked her down, we'll quickly grab the key while we're there. Oh, spice soup. Don't mind if I do. What kind of uh, hide is that? Feline, okay. He's got a taxidermied imp in his pocket. All right, let's see if there's anyone uh, in this cage. Please, please. Oh, there is. Oh, please, please. Yes, sir. I'll help you out. Come on out. 
Are you an innkeeper by chance? You set me free. You are. We got a flipping barkeeper. I, owe you <gasps> I am wasted as a fighter. Yes. My talents are in the barkeeper. Yes. I can keep you and yours happy with drink, and my ears suss out all manner of secrets and gossip. Hmm. Nice. We got a barkeeper. Let's go. Uh, let's get you away from their camp. Thralls are not allowed here. Okay, too far. Oh, okay. I gotta get him to follow me. Come on. I'll leave the guard in here for a second. He can take a smack. Where'd you go? All right, buddy. Follow you. Follow me. Come on. We'll put him somewhere where he's not going to get murdered all of a sudden. Imagine if we just got a barkeep finally, after about five goals or something with the cages, and then he. Oh wait, the golem. Oh, he can. They can both follow me. What? I haven't got the top authority thing. Oh well, I'm not going to question it. If it works, it works. That's, I owe uh, you much. Awesome. But... I am wasted as a fighter. Oh, sugar. Okay, okay, okay. Don't hit my barkeep. That's all I ask. Hold him. Get in there. Okay, smash his arm, please. Oh, my barkeeper's in there with his fists up. Imagine if the barkeeper took the uh, attention. Okay, we got it. Right. Pickaxe. Uh, we got 18 blood crystal from that this time. Also, I can confirm I did put some iron in his pocket and he mined out a nearby iron node while I was running around. So that was awesome. Right, guys, let's go. Homeward bound. I will continue the story once we get home. Alrighty. We have made it home with our barkeeper and somewhere around here, our golem. There we go. Uh, let's get you to stand guard over here next to Kong for a moment. And you, sir, welcome to your new abode. Yes, let's go. Finally. So what we do is we get him to stand guard and we put him in this special slot here behind the bar and there you go he's now serving drinks look he actually gets straight to it cleaning all the flagons and things and now we can come up to him talk to him and we've got the possibility to trade with him so items here that we can uh, I think we can just buy drinks from him I don't think we can sell him anything which is kind of a shame because we could make coin that way um, but now you've got a, a use for your gold coins. Pretty expensive, to be fair. <laughs> but anyway, hearty feast. Various drinks. Some bread, which is uh, useful for other uh, crafting purposes as well. Um, so, and let's have a look at what else he offers. Ah, so, in this contacts, um, no contacts available. So, what happens is over time people look there's an example right away wow that's so fast this guy's turned up zil the wanderer who we can talk to i know a hunter when i oh. see one and he will teach us lure corruption what does that do we learn i have no idea okay uh we can also give talk to me him a wild place give me wind whispering deadly secrets in the branches it's so cool that these voice actors give me a gravid moon <laughs> awesome. hanging heavy in a hungry sky setting my teeth on edge and my toes curling in the clay of blood and soil let's go howls <laughs> on the wind Blood awesome. on the tongue. I don't know what that uh, lure was. I think that's got something to do with... Uh, I thought that had something to do with the sacred hunt. Um, I'm... Yeah, I'm not entirely sure. I don't think that's anything we make or build or whatever. I think that's just... Uh, or maybe it's an emote thing. Oh, look, I think that lady may have just arrived as well. This place is going to get super busy now. Um, yeah, and over time, now that's a bit confusing because some of them will be our uh, 
our folks like that, Kelly. I'm not sure who this is. Some of them will be like this, where they have no name or anything. And you just can't interact with them at all. They're just patrons of the tavern. Um, and then others. Uh, oh, that's Tannery Tina. Um, this chap, for example, I don't think is one of ours. Uh, and he also, you can't interact with him. He's just enjoying a bowl of gruel or soup or whatever. That's Sawdust, our carpenter. Yeah. So, uh, when others arrive, you can talk to him, do enlist contacts, and it'll tell you if there are some, uh, some ones available for hire here. And again, you can spend some coin on them. Um, be aware also that, um, as with your own thralls, like this chap over here, who's just chilling by the bonfire, um, the, some of the people that visit your tavern, let's see, is this one of ours? Oh, that's Connell the Hammer. Okay, he's just hanging out there. Um, some of them will sit outside or just interact with things that are dotted around outside as well. Um, that's Ennis. Okay, she's got that fancy outfit. Yeah. Um, so if you don't see people or you see something to enlist or interact with, but you're not sure like where they are, they could be also outside of your tavern. If you, Especially if you put seating uh, outside like I've got here. Where you have other things that they can interact with around your village but wow this place the dog and sausage is really uh really taking off now getting super super popular oh that's so cool i can't believe we got the barman we got it working straight away and i can't believe that zil the wanderer actual story npc named story npc uh turned up that's so funny all right oh who's this chap it's another patron just wandered in uh, he doesn't have any name or anything to interact with either, so I'm guessing he's not going to be listed as a contact. No, there you go. Um, but yeah, that's uh, that's the barkeep. Awesome. I was really chuffed with that. I didn't think we'd uh, we'd get that amount of luck. Ah, while we were out and about, we also got <laughs> this lightning rod head. Uh, so we already have a head for our next golem. I don't know what that's going to do or give us. It's conductive. So, hmm. Attracts lightning strikes, including alchem those alchemically created by unknowable essences. Oh. So, I wonder if that means he can then strike out at people with the... Uh, as part of that. Hmm. Curious. Okay, that could be pretty cool. All right. Uh, Tannery Tina. So, let's see. Uh, we did get some more blood crystal. So now we would be able to make, for example, a stone guardian uh, torso. But I think I'm going to see if I can save points and learn the uh, learn about the next level. Because I think that's really fun. <laughs> I'm sold on these. So there's brimstone coating, there's tar coating, and then there's iron. Let's go for iron level. There we go. We'll unlock that. And then Iron Guardian Tools. Okay. Neat. And then there's Crystalline, but that unlocks at level 45. So we've got a ways to wait until that. Oh, fantastic. Okay. Have we got anything else we can use our points on right now that I want to look at? Oh, yeah. We talked a little bit about tinkering. We can have a look at that. All right. Uh, also, Journey, I switched to the Sorcerer track. So we had find and defeat a sorcerer done. Find the hidden cave. Okay. We know. I wonder if that means reading the map like that. Or it means actually, I think it means actually going to Turek's cave again. So I'm probably just going to do that one off uh, outside of the recording. Uh, touch the tome. Okay. So these are the things we did before. And then access, place and access, a thaumaturgy bench. We got that upgrade your tome and cast a spell. So some of those we can do already, obviously, because we've been there. I, I'm, I'm not convinced that it shouldn't retroactively complete your journey once you switch to it at the very least. Because, you know, you've done it. So it's purely repetitive. Um, oh, wow. So you actually have to do it strictly in that order as well. Wow. Okay. Yeah, I'll take care of that off the stream. And, uh, and we'll get ourselves this funky helmet here. Acheronian Legate. Nice. That's cool. So we can unlock some extra gear without using too much fancy stuff from the uh, from the DLCs I've got. Oh, here we go, Kelly. You can have a 
better outfit. Look at that, that's cool. Neat. We got that off that fella there. Alright. Or do we do the purge now that we have the golem? Oh, we have the tavern open as well. Kinda wanna get myself a uh wanna get myself a better fighter maybe, but I think we should trust it in red shirt. Let's see that red shirt is properly armed. So he's armed and armored. He's got all heavy armor now, 559. Five, he's got some food. Do you know what? Let's put our, literally put our stake in the ground. And uh, let's try the purge because I've never tried the purge since the system changed. Okay, let's do, we're doing it live. This will be fun. Uh, actually, are we going to repair my weapons? Repair my weapons. <laughs> what could possibly go wrong? Okay. Um, yeah. Let's go. Oh, I can keep Gaseous Orb. I might use that. Bonty said that's really good during the fight. So, yeah, let's do that too. All right, because the worst case scenario here, they trash the base and then I have to build a new base. <laughs> All right, let's do it. Let's do the purge. What could possibly go wrong? Proclaim my wealth. Beware, exile, but by proclaiming your wealth, you will draw the attention and greed of the Stygian Empire to your door. Their armies will assault your stronghold and seek your treasure. The greater the prize, the greater the threat. You cannot build during a purge. Prepare your defenses. Let's go. Bring it. Bring it on. I d <sighs> the main thing I'm worried about, to be honest, is I've got a couple of really, really good trolls like Connell and especially Ennis here and I kind of don't want to lose Ennis <sighs> maybe I should make her some heavy armor well <laughs> now I'm panicking now I'm panicking let's make her some heavy armor too there is no reachable location for the purge to set up their base camp oh what Oh no, does that mean it's not going to work because of the position of my base? Or does it mean they're just going to attack without a camp or something? I don't... Hmm. That kind of sucks. That sucks loads. That's really anticlimactic. Okay. Alright. Okay, well, we can make some nice armor for Ennis anyway. Ennis, put this on, my dear. I really want you to survive. As and when we do. Get a so maybe we can never have one here. I don't know. Oh, that's so disappointing. There we go. You know, that stuff's probably better than some of the others I've got on already. What about you, Tannery Tina? Since you work the tannery, maybe you need to dress differently. There we go. What have you got on? Okay, you're good apart from sandals. Oh man, so since I've built here and you got that camp there, uh, it says there's nowhere nearby for them to set up their camp. So I'm assuming they won't attack us. Oh, that's so sad. That's a silly system. We try again. They're scouting my camp. Like, surely they could just set up... Oh, I suppose they can't cross the water. What if I built a bridge here? I might build a quick bridge. Uh, a way across. And then they might be able to set up over here. Let's do that. Alrighty. I have now built a uh, bridge across 
we're gonna try this again scouting uh, it's a, just a very very simple bridge actually using the bridge pieces we'd unlocked because I thought that would be kind of cool and let's see if they can uh, see if they can work this out now that we're connected to the in air quotes mainland from our little island here oh man I hope this works let's go game give me a fight give me a grand fight there's no reachable location of the person set up their bait oh my god oh what well how is this not reachable it's like we're literally connected to that did i have to physically connect it to my base oh i'm gonna take it out on these locals Wait, Ross or Krana of the Devils? Who are you? You're another named thrall at our little camp here. That's crazy. Try not to kill her. Okay, he's down. Oh, she might bleed out as well. Oh no, oh no, oh no. I put a bleed. I put a bleed. Don't die. Don't die. She didn't die. Okay, I need her to get into an animation lock so I can get my truncheon. Okay, number six. Who are you? Ow. Oh, hello. Didn't know that ledge was there like that. God take you. That's the first time I hit her. <laughs> Ow! What? Oh my God, God take you. Okay. Really, Ros Rosalind, we need to have a chat about your attitude. Uh you're a builder. What does that mean you're gonna give us? Oh. Alright, well sucks about the purge thing. So I guess I'm just lucked out because of where I built. That's, uh, yeah. You don't even have the bigger wheel yet. Okay, yeah, I wonder what benefits she's going to give us. Huh. Fascinating. Okay. Still, still love that we're learning stuff in this game as we as we go along. Anyway, uh, so that's sad. Uh, I guess we're not doing the purge today then. Oh, man. I would have thought this was enough. Okay, I'm going to have another go. We'll build a bigger, proper, like, bridgeway. Just, like, some foundations across the water. And we'll take it from there. All right. I have triggered the purge once more. And I have built a normal just two-by-two... Two some foundations and some ceilings across rather than a special bridge so this is now in total three wide as you can see maybe maybe the game will let them build over here somewhere to attack it, i wonder if it's also the area because we built a new new river oh no no reachable location for the purge what it's kind of crazy. I wonder if I move Jeff and put Jeff on the on that in that bridge area. I'm gonna try that. It's the only other idea I've got right now. If you know how to fix this in the comments, do let me know. One thousand seven hundred and one thousand seven hundred and ten. Rat. Rat. Put you over here on the bridge. Like they couldn't have an easier route to get here. Claim well confirmed. Scouting. Now I might have to suddenly panic and move him indoors. <laughs> the other problem is is if this does work and they're all over here. 
I'm relying on all my thralls to be fighting with me. And they're all over there. <laughs> I guess I could try and lead the enemy across the bridge. If that happens. I, I don't know exactly how this uh, looks. I've never done that, as I said. Uh-oh. Uh-oh, what was that noise? What was that noise? Oh, there's their camp. Oh, they're now encamped up there. That's just appeared. Oh, here they come. Okay, quick. Move. I've got to move you. Oh, he's hiding. Oh, that's hilarious. Okay, uh, move. Keep moving. I'm going to move him indoors, hopefully. He's terrified. Oh, poor Jeff. Jeff's terrified. Come on, guys. Get ready for a fight. Open the door. Hold the door. Hold door. Okay. Close the door. Where are the bad guys? Here they are. Get them. Okay, it's an XL level two. Where's all the others? Get them, gang. Kill. Murder, death, kill. Go. Yes. Oh, my guys have come out for the fight. Oh, gaseous orb. Don't forget the gaseous orb. Number eight. Chuck it at them. There we go. Wait, you're chasing me. You don't. That's not friendly. Hello, my dear. Have it. Oh, this is all kicking off now. Oh. Uh, I've got no stamina again, as usual. Okay. Chuckles, get back in the fight, Chuckles. Okay. It's the blooming archers are the problem. Did you see that? Maybe we need to build guard towers and have archers next time. Who's this guy with the big battering ram? He's coming for me gold. How are we doing, guys? My dancers are just here, out here dancing. Get him. Yes. Fight them off. Oh, this is uh, hilarious. They've come with so many... Uh, I suppose I could get one of my guys to follow me. Where's Ennis? I, oh, I'm really worried that what Ennis still have gone down. You follow me. Come on, Guardian. Somebody went down. Ow! Okay, lots of mine are down, I think. Yeah, look, I've got loads down. But you can get them back up into the fight. Come on, Tina. Oh, I don't know if it was a good idea. Yes. Get them. These blooming archers, man. They're cheating bringing so many archers. Zara is down. Chuckles is down again. He went down twice. Come on. Look at this chap here. He's the demolisher. So he's the guy charged with smashing down my doors and getting to the treasure. Well, unfortunately for him. What the heck? Oh, no. King Kong's little wee brother went down. Get him! Oh no, I'm stuck. Okay, I'm out. You can have it. Get him, Tina. Yes. Good job. Oh my god, so many of my troops are down. <laughs> Get back in the fight, both of you. Oh, you revived two at one. That's cool. Oh, that's awesome. I didn't realize that everyone who's in range. And this guy's the big boss guy. Get him. Oh, I, can't, I can't hit him now because I've, I've got it in order. So it's not the smartest AI. He's just wandering around looking for his like, Where's the rest of my troops? <laughs> well, guess what, buddy? They didn't last that well. He's drowning now. Oh, he's got another one in the water. Sneaky. They've got underwater troops. Submarine warfare. Have it. Demolisher dead. Okay. What about this guy? Come on. Get out of the water. 
Okay, I'll have to use a bow. And hope I can shoot him in the water. Yeah, I can. <laughs> this is crazy. <laughs> Don't they drown? They can no longer reach the coffer and have decided to retreat. Bunch of cowards. Okay. So let's go have a look at their camp. Uh, I should take Gong with me. Come on. Oh my goodness. And now I'm going to have to find all of my folks and move them back in to the base. All right, what's happening up here? I hear a crocodile. Nope, never mind. So this is their camp. So you see what I had to do? I had to build that bridge across and then bring Jeffrey out. So for some reason they decided they couldn't get to the coffer. I wonder if it's because I had a tier two base, but surely not. All right, and then once they're all defeated, locked. How do I? On what? Oh no! So is it because I had to leave the coffer out the side? Oh man! Okay. So the system is like, nah, you can't reach it now. So we're okay. You know what? We'll try that again. Oh, these guys are gonna constantly fight if I leave my guys right next to where this spawn is. It's kind of hilarious. Yeah, they don't do too well, do they? All right. Um, so Zara. Okay. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to put leave Jeff. We'll have to bring Jeff out here. We'll have a big fight on the bridge. Too far. Rules not allowed here. What? 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 Oh my God. Okay. So Zara, follow me. Guard here. Okay. Wow, what a fat this is. Oh, hello. Carpenter number three. God take you. Okay. Right, you follow. <laughs> oh my goodness. What a faff. What a faff. But you know, we're doing it live, at least we're seeing how it uh how it is. So you guard there. Come on, Chuckles. Same deal. Follow. And we'll leave Jeff. Actually, we could build something. Why don't we build something a bit sturdier? Yeah, I mean, they mostly just came with archers, so... I think my guys can be... Well, my guys also went down like sacks of suds. So I want to say I shouldn't be so... Uh, so confident, maybe. Come on, Amy. All right, Amy, you go there. Thank you. Let's get Kong. So we'll just surround Jeff with all of our fighters and see what's the worst that could happen. We lose all our treasure. <laughs> That'd be sad. Yeah, I'll build something in the middle here. We could have a platform. It looks like we just have to... Oh, hello. Oh, wow. That was impressive, buddy. That was impressive. I wonder how long that takes to wear off the fact that they've been downed. All right. So at least this way we can shoot. Look at Red Shirt. He didn't get involved in the fight whatsoever. Lazy beggar. Lazy beggar. Come on. Follow me. I think if we'd have had Red Shirt, maybe we wouldn't have seen so many of ours going down. But I don't know. Those archers, man, that is mean. That is really mean. I could I could put a couple of mine up in towers, I suppose. Right, you stand there. That's quite a formidable troop we're building up there. Looking good, looking good. Uh, who are you? Tavern Hire Chimerian Alchemist level 2. 50 gold. Oh, there you go. So that's uh, a hireable patron. A Shemite Bearer level 3 for 100 gold. A little oh, that's you again. Sorry, buddy. Between kills. Uh, you are no one. You are no one. Uh, that's Tina. That's that guy again. 
Hire a smelter level one for 10 gold. There you go. So it starts at 10 gold. Hire an alchemist one for 10 gold. And you, young lady, are uh, an alchemist level one as well. So there you go. There's an alternate way rather than doing the whole bonking over the head and whatnot. There's an alternate way to get yourself some thralls. And they're coming in at various different tiers. Brick top smelter. Um, okay, so we know what we might even be able to keep our. Uh... What's going on here? They've smashed the floor in. Try... Oh, so they were trying to get. I don't know if that means I've won the purge or I've lost the purge. To be honest with you. All right, come on, Jeff. So they smashed in the foundations trying to get into our base because the foundations were only tier one. Oh my lord, even though the smashy smashy guy didn't look like he made it in. Alright, so let's do... Let's set up. I'm going to set up some sturdier foundations like using this stone brick here. And we'll see. I don't know if they'll even attack it though if I do stone brick. Alright, well let's see what happens. I'm going to build some stuff up and uh, we'll be back when that is uh, good and done. Because I'm going to need a whole load of spare parts. Alrighty, a few moments later, I have built this little uh, watchtower -y kind of thing. Uh, Jeff's in here, we're going to try the purge again. Uh, there's an upper level. I've put a couple of the, uh, uh, Tina here and, um, the Zara. And I've given them some bows so we can fight back against their archers since they seem to come archer strong. Also, uh, Amy here's got a, a bow and a, uh, cutlass. So, uh, we're going to try her actually. I got her in here to protect Jeff as a last line of defense. Uh, I've made the base, the bottom of it, and the walls and the doors out of tier 2 um, stone brick. Uh, the fences are tier 1. For the most part, they're above. Um, just because I don't expect them to take much damage. And I've put a bunch of um, pillars for it to stand on underneath. So, a uh, bit of a risky... Risking it for the biscuits. I've lined up most of my fighters here actually let's go and get kong's wee brother uh where is kong's wee brother oh he's on the other side of the bridge i think in case they came the other side i think they're gonna cut okay and then we're gonna give this we're gonna do it live we're gonna give this another go and see if they don't retreat this time uh i don't know if that means we have to go and uh fight them uh over on the beaches but yeah let's get our troops lined up we've got the tank there at the front there gg uh yeah let's uh let's give it a go right so jeff proclaim wealth go they are scouting let's see if we see them uh spawn their camping down there i'm assuming because it's the same kind of deal as before that they're gonna set a camp up down there uh, I've not changed the bridge other than changing some of the floor pieces. Actually, no, I have changed it slightly. I've extended out the flooring to the other part that's connected to those either uh, bridge side there. But if anything, there's more of a path now than there was before. Uh oh. Oh, wow. It's set up on this side now. Oh, snapperino. So they're going to come this way. Oh, that's that's much worse quick get the guards to this side oh my goodness tank gg i need you buddy i need you in fact you should probably follow me in the fight too far oh my god follow me red shirt to battle Hear their drums beating. Oh, here they come. Oh, they're all in the water. Oh, don't tell me they've all got stuck over there. That would be embarrassing. We could go and pick them off, though. Come on, red shirt. 
Surely they've got to come this way. We're really breaking the logic. They can no longer reach the coffer and decided to retreat. What? What? Is the base too strong for them or why are they retreating? This makes no sense. Oh, let's kill old Redbeard here. We gained another level. That's uh, cool. Let's get him. What? Why have they retreated again? There's their Muppets. I like that the crocodile is still here, even though they put their camp up. Couldn't even be, be bothered to kill the crocodile. Oh, I think there's a sandstorm coming. <sighs> Locks. I can't do anything with that. All right. Okay. Well, attempt number two with the purge has failed. Quick, let's get home. <sighs> I don't know. Do they just give up? Is it the, I think it might be the power thing. But from the other side, it looked like it would work. All right, we've got 80% shelter and 100% shelter. 80%. 100%. There we go. <laughs> There's no reachable location. Huh. Okay, I'm going to remove... I wonder if I just remove these doors. They then will do it. Oh, that's so cool. I rarely get to see the storm leaving like that. Awesome. Cool effect. Alright, let's wait for the loud drum banging in that of the Stygian camp. If they set up over here, I feel like we've got a chance. Oh, 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 something's coming. Oh, they set up over there. Now we'll get to see if it's the pathing. Oh, they're further inland this time. Are you sure? All right, let's go. Come on, red shirt. Okay, you're still following. Good, let's go. This seems dumb though that I can't have doors. That 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 can't be right. I think it might be the tier of the doors. Here they come. Come on. Yeah. Let's go, buddy. In the name of Set, identify yourself. How about, how about you set or for no? That guy's going after the treasure. Oh, they have archers up on these things there. Let's go. Can't climb that? Oh, really? Oh, wow. You can't get up there. That's cheeky, isn't it? Hey, you. In the name of set. We'll just beat your soldier up while you're here. So let's just decided that the game's just decided we're going to take injury. Because they got archers everywhere. That we can't get to. I'm assuming I've got to beat this guy to get the key to the coffers. To... Heal. Quick, heal, 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 heal. Use their cover against them. Cover. Red shirt's down. Oh no, that's not good. Ow, you so-and-so. Can I, can I not be punching? Can I maybe be using my weapons instead? Please, how silly am I? Oh goodness, there's loads of them. Oh, get back in the tent. Oh! <laughs> Damn it! This is not the purge excitement that I was planning on. Oh no! Of course I'm. Oh, I'm completely naked. Oh, how am I going to get my gear from that camp? I'm not. Red troops down. Oh, here come my. Oh, here they come. 
Jeez, I, I have to I have to remember this. I have to set myself up for a spare set of armor. Dead prisoner. Jeffrey's hiding. Get him, GG. Get him, buddy. Why are you coming down here with your bow? Okay. Ah. Uh, so things seem a bit weird here. Uh, follow me, GG. I gotta get my gear back. Or well, maybe I should leave him here actually to defend. Oh God. No, oh, stand guard. Stand guard. Go fight. I wonder. I gotta see if I can get my gear back. Oh, I learned a really important lesson that we need to have a second set of gear. At least my passive heal's helping me. I'm not going to get past these archers, am I? Where did I go down here? Get, take all. Yes. Oh, it puts your gear on for you. Nice. Ow. Hold up. Hold up. Oh, that was a heavy bow hit. Run away. Run away. Heal up. Oh. I kind of want to fight off the... Right, please. Have it. Oh, hello. Okay. Okay, you're dead. Uh, have I got any more aloes? I have. Ah! Where did they all come from? Oh my god. This, oh, they're so tenacious. I like it. I don't know if you're the same ones from the camp. I'm in big trouble here. Ow! Kong is down. Oh, run away. No, stop it. Stop! Stop engaging when you're not ready. Ah. <laughs> I'm sorry, buddy. I want to get you back in the fight, but I can't. I got to get a heal on. Oh my god, oh no, it's done the Q-Log thing. No one can't stand that. Oh, that's so frustrating. I uh, pressed Q, but I, I, could, uh, I need to move that mapping. Oh, that's so annoying. You were killed by the war Master of War Slaves. Wait, does that mean I've lost entirely? Get back in the fight. All of you. Enemies at the gate. Get back in the fight. I'm stuck in Kong's box. Take all. Okay. Can we equip our healing potions now into slot number two, please, game? Thank you. I think our, our Golem has been the real winner of this. Get in there, guys. Get them. No, don't surrender. Oh my god. Right, okay. GG, come with me. We'll see if we can get we can see if we can get red shirt back. Oh, there's another wave coming. Goodness, this is a fight. Get him. Kill him all. Oh my goodness. Get them. Filthy archers. Have it. Filthy archers. You're going down, buddy. Can't stand them. Get them. Yes, yeah, still in the fight. Good, good, good. Ow, I got hit. Oh my god, he's gonna dump me, isn't he? I'm gonna lose my golem. Set will glory in your death. 
I'll stop it with the unequipping the weapon in the water. <laughs> so annoying. No. Oh. Oh my God. Having him out here is a bad idea. Come back. Flee. They're stealing all my treasure. That's my treasure. I worked hard for that. Oh, this is so cool. I'm getting absolutely battered. They've got all my treasure. Stop with the random buttons. God. Gosh, without the golem, we would be so screwed. Oh, the archers are so annoying. Ah, run! Run! <laughs> run away. Get back in the fight. Everybody get back in the fight. I can't move. I can't move. I'm stuck. In the water. Save yourself. <laughs> Save yourself, Grumbles. Okay, big fella. You are not taking all my treasure, okay? Have it. Have it. Kill him. Kill the demolisher. Oh, they knocked the big guy off the bridge. Biscuits. No! Not with the archery, you cheats. Filthy, filthy archers. Okay. That's my treasure. I'm sorry, Jeffrey. Oh my god, they've stolen so much of my wealth. Okay. Come on, guys. Uh, GG. Come with me. Let's see if we can get red shirt back up. Gosh, this is crazy. How long is this going on for until we defeat the guy at their camp, maybe? Oh, that's so annoying. And now I'm eating, drinking potions when I don't even need them. Down you go, son. Down you go. Oh, get out of the water, man. Get it. Get your head smashed in or knocked off. Let's go. Wow, they're really tough. Oh. Get back in the fight, Red Shirt. We need everyone on point. No, stop punching. Get the weapons out. How do you beat the archers then if you can't barely kill them? The Stygian Hand of War challenges you. Oh, okay. Challenge accepted. Ow, except no. Oh my God, this is crazy. Oh, there he is. <laughs> GG was killed while following you. We've lost GG. We lost our golem. This guy's a nuts. Help. 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 Oh, God. Okay, he's come out to challenge us. If 
if we can beat this guy, maybe we win. Oh, no stamina again. Oh, wow. Get him, whoever you are. I think that's Ennis. Yeah, we gave her the... Oh, what do you call it? Yes. No. Get him. Die. Yes. Victory. <gasps> Take all his key. Oh, my God. That was absolutely bananas. I love your head, son. That was just the craziest thing ever. <laughs> oh, my God god oh that was really fun but wow i'm not used to that much kind of button button mashing oh wow i'll have my gemstones back thank you oh wow so okay so the tier two doors seemed to make them decide that they couldn't win or it was the pathing we finally got the camp to uh, spawn somewhere advantageous. So do these give up now? Do they surrender? They got their hands up. Well, somebody's still active. Come on, Richard. No, it's not stop harvesting eggs. Okay. Weapons out. So they've given up, except not this guy. Because this guy is uh, whatever. He doesn't give up. Wow, that did almost no damage. What the heck armor does he have on? Oh, red shirt's down. Ow, you son of a biscuit. Get him, crocodile. You're on my side. We're on Team Croc. Holy cow, that guy is in possible to kill crocodile i thought we, we had an arrangement buddy oh my god even the crocodile's trying to murder me here come on i'll draw you out of your camp yeah there you go then they've got more space to fight in i wish i had something to uh heal with Ow, he did a double, triple, oh my, wow. Literally sliced, sliced me in half. <laughs> How can I beat the master of the hand or whatever he was called and then I can't take out this bonobo? Oh, well, it's all kicking off around the dog and sausage, isn't it? What I wouldn't give for a healthy golem. Um, all right, Kong. Let's go. My goodness. Uh, I need to get him some food. That's probably the other thing is I didn't give them all... Um, they didn't all have stacks of uh, food in their pocket. So I think that didn't help. Uh. Hello, can we press the button? I'm all stressed now. <laughs> can you tell? <laughs> <laughs> oh wow that was absolutely crazy oh what's my gear look like right now maybe we can at least make some weak uh, bandages or something my gear looks okay actually not too bad probably because i've been going down so fast it don't matter oh gosh okay let's go we just got to beat this one guy. We've got the keys. I don't want this thing to... Uh, I don't know why he hasn't given up the fight. Where's Red Shirt? Is Red Shirt dead dead? Oh, there's the rest of our golem. Ow. Come on. We've got to do a three against one here. He's going to just murder us so badly. No, that's not fair. Oh, I hate when you get locked by, like, Kong just collapsed on me. 
Can I maybe just unlock his... Uh... How can Stygian Soldier 3 be tougher than the Hand of War or whatever he was called? Oh, you girls having a good time up there just dancing on the roof? Oh, is there some aloe here? No. Okay, let's go get some more healing pots. I'm being silly because I haven't... Uh, I got stressed. I forgot what I was doing. <laughs> Okay, let's get some healing potions and we'll go and get our kit gear. I think Red Shirt may have died. I'm going to be really annoyed though if uh, the game doesn't let me at least get the stuff. I deserve the stuff. More authority points. And they were getting healed in battle while I was doing damage as well, but... We're going to need a new golem. I can't have to surely get a new golem just to be able to fight this one guy in the camp. I, as you can see how valuable the tank is though, the tankiness of the golem, just to take their attention. Halt. In the name of Set. Um, I have no armor, sir. So maybe... The camp just despawned! The camp just despawned! Oh my god, I've been cheated out of my earnings. <gasps> what? They killed my gorilla as well. I get some thick hide out of this. What? They killed my golem. They killed my... And bloody red shirt survived. My unique gorilla. <laughs> Maybe we can get another one from underneath the... <laughs> In that dungeon again, I don't know. But they killed King Kong's wee brother. They killed... Uh, uh, the golem. They killed me I don't know how many times. Oh, you've got to be kidding me, man. <sighs> I'm going to look up what I can use that head for. That carcass for. Oh, wow. And the worst of all, the worst of all, I didn't get the treasure. I still have the commander's keys times. Oh my God. I didn't get the treasure. Oh, I should have just, I was that, that last time I was nervous about the time. So I was going to just try and get to the vault. Oh. I'd use Kong as like a distraction. Oh man, that so sucks. And we lost like, what do we have? Nearly a thousand or something? We got 300 left. Oh my God. Oh, well, there you go. That's a purge, folks. Far from a well-oiled system. It's heavily flawed, but you know, it is what it is, man. Oh, I wish if they could have taken us on at our camp, I think, like that first spawn over there, I think we had a a bit of a chance. I'm kind of glad I didn't have Anis with me. She hits like an absolute truck, but I wouldn't have wanted to lose uh, Ennis to that shenanigans. Um, also, we're going to have to take stock of how many people we did. Scout, right? Okay. Did we lose our blacksmiths? No, we have bladesmith four still. So, I think that means we didn't lose. Let's go into the tavern and have a look. Uh, well, we... Okay, we've still got Bricktop, our smelter. Okay, that's good. Um, who else have we got in here? These are patrons. That's a patron guy. Oh, actually, the easiest way is to have a look on our followers list. Oh, my goodness. Oh. So we lost Chuckles, the hyena. We lost uh, Kong, King Kong's wee brother, our gorilla. We still have our barkeep. We have Tannery Tina survived. Bricktop survived. Connell the hammer is still alive. That's good. He's returning home from somewhere. I don't know where. Ennis. Hey, we've got Ennis still alive. Sorry, our named ones we've still got. We've got our performers... Kelly, our cook survived. Harry, the sorcerer, survived as well. Okay, 
So in terms of our crew, we did okay. Uh, in terms of winning some some tre losing our treasure and winning their stuff, yeah. So one thing I would definitely take from that as well, apart from learning a bit that the the system isn't you know perfect, let's say. Um, in terms of the pathing and everything, is we definitely need a better base in terms of defendable like walls uh arches i tried putting arches up on those little mini battlements um and the result was not very pleasing the archers didn't really seem to do that much so maybe i should have had them like facing on the other side or something but you'd think that they would react in like the same sort of radius maybe they did during the fight i didn't see oh there you are richard so Red Shirt survived, but he's on his, like, last legs. Oh, I can't believe we didn't get those... We didn't get those crates. All right. I'm going to go and have a break. Uh, this might be the end of this episode because it's got a lot of excitement in it, so it might be a shorter one. Um, but, yeah, let me know how you thought I did. Uh, I think, obviously, I've learned that I need to build a more decent structure. We probably could have put some tier 1 doors on there to slow them down as well. Just seeing the treasure. Um, but even though I got a bit stressed out during it, I uh, had a lot of fun. That's that's a fun one to look back on. All right, good vibes, everybody. Uh, if this is the end of the episode, hope you enjoyed. Thumbs up, subscribe, all the good things. And uh, I will see you in the next one.